Hey everyone, it's Corleone from Lightcast Studios. Welcome back to episode 2. Today we're going to be talking about the project bin. And basically what we want to do is to import a file into the project bin, uh, we want to d either double click the project bin and or uh, just go into file, import, um, file, and or multiple files. And the project bin is basically where everything is stored on your computer or on your composition and so it's just giving you links to different files and in order to import them, as I said before, just double click it, which is what I usually like to do. And let's let's just import some files. You can either highlight a lot of them and click open. We can import s single files by clicking import file and selecting a single file. We can also import multiple files by clicking file import multiple files. And the window will keep popping up until you click done. So let's give you an example. Let's click lighthouse, penguins, and tulips. Now all these images have been imported and we look like we're done importing these files. But let's say we want to import a video file. We go to videos. Let's import our sample video, which I really like to use as, exam as examples. And so now we got a video file and a bunch of pictures. And now we have a bunch of different type of file types, JPEGs and WMVs. And we want to organize our um, files into uh, different categories so we don't get confused later on because After Effects does get confusing. And so when you have things organized in the project bin, you know where to place everything in the composition window when you're working with more than one composition and things like that. And it does get confusing unless you are organized. To do this, you need to create what is called a folder. You can either click create a new folder. You can either right click uh, a new folder as well uh, and stuff like that. So we're going to click new folder and we're going to make a folder for the pictures and a folder for the uh, videos. And now we're going to make a folder for the um, videos by clicking the button at the bottom. And now we have two folders and we're going to drag this, drag all these files into the pictures folder like so. And then we're going to drag the wildlife into videos. We want to color code them exactly to what we feel like. Let's make this fuchsia. I don't know why, but you know, make them all fuchsia so we know that they're all part of the, uh, you know, pictures. And that gets handy when you're using them in the time timeline and things like that. So now that we have that color coded, we want to make the video color coded to yellow and make that yellow. And now that we have everything color coded, um, that's about it. So, um, you know, now that you got the project bin down, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments. And that's basically all you can do with the project bin. It's very simple. The main focus of what we're trying to get through to you guys is the fact that you need to keep things organized and talk about um, what you can do and how to import files into the project bin. So uh, don't forget to check out my next video. In our next video, we're going to be talking about the timeline, and then we're going to be talking about the composition and the rest of the panels that we're going to be going over and all the other little goodies that come with After Effects. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to comment, subscribe, and until next time, this is Lightcast Studios, and thanks for watching.